And yes, the title is correct. Let me see if I can give you guys a better look. Oh, I was hoping to um, see if I could go wider. I mean, the whole point is seeing me play on the hoverboard. And yes, I am behind the screen. If you're new to the channel, um, don't forget to uh, hit the like and um, and subscribe if you like what you see. Welcome, I see somebody in here. If I don't uh, see your comments, I'm sorry. So, um, I am um, getting my mental game back on the road, trying to get kick-started back. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do nine racks. I'm gonna be playing bang time pools, um, nine ball rules. So I'm gonna do, I'm gonna see what I could get with the uh, hoverboard. I'm not on the hoverboard yet, so um, wish me luck. Um, the whole point of this is trying to get my mental mind focused. If you guys seen my videos, I've mentioned sometimes that I do jump on a hoverboard whenever I'm not shooting well. And right now, my mental game's been off for like two months. Um, I'm hoping, you know, at least this gets my mind off of, uh, you know, where my mind's at right now. And uh, focus more on the shots. So, I'm gonna be doing nine racks. I'm gonna keep score and, and the racks there. So, let's see what I could get with nine racks. And I do have a match tonight at um, nine o'clock Eastern on Bang Time Pool. So, Darren, if you're watching, good luck, buddy. I hope we both shoot him well. And, um, like I say, wish me luck. If I don't catch your comments, I will be checking them after the fifth rack. I'll take a little break, depending on how I feel being on the hoverboard that long. There might be some shots that I won't be able to reach, but like I said, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take what it is and just add up the score for what I get. Um, I was trying to get a better view for you guys, but uh, you guys will see I'm on the hoverboard the whole time. So um, uh, let's get this started. It has been a while. It has been a while, so um, <laughs> like I said, wish me luck. But if you guys, all right, let me um, let me get used to it real quick. All right, it seems like it rolls pretty good. And um, I did just get the room uh, redone and this is one of the reasons why I got this kind of carpet was so I could be able to uh, practice with my hoverboard. If you guys are wondering why, why the hoverboard, you know? <laughs> um, and like I said, when you're on this thing and you're trying to shoot, and you're not only not wanting to fall, but you're concentrating on the shot. There's nothing else on your mind, but your focus on what you're doing. And I haven't done this much. I only do this once in a great while, and I haven't been playing my best. So I'm hoping this would uh, kickstart my game a little. So all right, right now, like I said, we're gonna be doing. I'm gonna be doing nine racks. Right now, I'm gonna be. Uh, this is gonna be rack number one. And then we'll see what the score is and we'll add them up. Uh, and I hope, uh, like I said, everything goes well and you guys enjoy what you see. So don't forget to um, hit that like and subscribe if you haven't. And we are doing a three-point rule, so I have to make sure. I'm not going to get too specific on that three points, on the three-point rule where uh, a couple of them have to come past the head stream. So, um, like I said, I am on the hoverboard. So, 
Wish me luck. I don't know what you guys can see, but uh, all right, here goes. This is uh, rack number one. And like I said, this is bank time pool rules. So it's a basic game of nine ball. I do get ball in hand after the rack if I choose. And I'll continue going with the rules as I go. And this is how, uh, uh, just to see how many points I could get with nine racks. Take ball in hand. And like I said, welcome. If I miss your text, I'm sorry. But I am a little bit busy. <laughs> I'm trying to stay alive on this thing. Let me uh, see if I can get this thing real quick going and See, so make sure everything's working. So, like I said, I am taking ball in hand. Let me just make sure it did go live. All right, it says I'm live. Wow, I got several people here. Thank you guys for uh, pressing the like, by the way. I'm just writing something. Welcome, everybody. All right. So I'm going to take ball in hand. Like I said, I'm going to be shooting the nine racks on the hoverboard and see how much I, how many, how many points I get. I do have to go in sequence, like I said, it's a game of nine ball. And I do have to concentrate a lot. So, that's rack number one. So far, it looks like I might have made a ball on the break, hopefully I did. I'm not going to beat up myself right now because, uh, like I said, this is uh, a little bit challenging already. I am trying to beat 19 points, though. So, I got two points. That's rack number one. So, let's go to rack number two. At rack, rack number five, I will be taking a break. Not a break, but I'll look at, I'll take a look at your comments. Like I said, this is the first one and it's okay. I got a feeling I'm gonna do better. And this is the uh, rack that I have, the same pattern I'm gonna be using for tonight. And like I said, there's going to be some shots that are going to be challenging because, you know, this requires a lot of balancing and a lot of concentration. break. I'm glad that that three ball opened up. I'm liking the spread. I am going to take ball in hand. So after the break, I'm allowed to take ball in hand. I could only score nine points from this point on if I run the whole rack. If I don't take ball in hand, it's 11 points. 
And like I said, um, this is a little challenging. Yeah, I was trying to give you guys a better look. I hope you guys are able to see all the movements and stuff so you guys can uh, understand what I have to go through just trying to keep uh, balance. Get in there. Oh, I needed that luck. All right. Like I said, I am loosening up. So it looks like I got one point. I am going to be 19, I'll tell you that. I have to be 19. <laughs> All right, so I got one here. That might be the only point. Yep. It only goes up from there. I mean, that's one point. I'm going to get more. Like I said, you guys would understand that I am challenging myself. And the pockets are a little bit tight. Let me show you guys. These are, if you're new to the channel and you haven't been here, I'm playing on a, about three and three quarter inch pockets. So that's another little challenging part of being on a hoverboard, the pockets, and like I said, trying to keep track. But I do need to make more points than one point, I'll tell you that. All right, let's uh, let's do better than one. Wish me luck. I'll go ahead and um, take ball in the hand. Welcome. Sorry if I haven't seen your comments. So I'm going to take ball in the hand. I need the chop. <laughs> I think I need to carry a chuck with me. So it looks like I made the three. I need to go in sequence. So one, two, four, five, six, seven. two points. Yeah, I got to get used to the, the height I'm on the hoverboard right now. So my stroke's going to be a little bit off from my usual stroke. So I'll get that figured out right now. I, I do shoot better on this thing, I promise. <laughs> oh. So the other rack was one point. This one's two points, we're on rack number three. I forgot about the score, sorry. So right now it's five points with three racks. And I'm trying to beat 19 points. And you're trying to say, why 19 points? 19 points 
I think has been the lowest point uh, over at Bank Time Pool. So I'm gonna try to beat it with this hoverboard. And like I said, I do have to do the pattern, the same pattern or else it is a zero if you don't hit the pattern. And I usually do shoot better. Like I said, I'm getting used to the balance of the hoverboard and my, my stroke. I'm actually happy. I'm happy with the spreads, I'll tell you that. I wish I wasn't on the hoverboard <laughs> hitting spreads like that. All right, let's get more than, more than three. Get in there. Nice. I I am not gonna take ball in hand. Oh wait. What happens is this is the four, that's the three. I will take ball in hand. I need to uh, land somewhere in here. So I can only get nine points right now. All right, so I'm going for nine points. Welcome if you just got here. Like I said, I need to try to squeeze in in between there or at least here or here would be good. Somewhere in there or here. I could still cut it from there. So I'm gonna see what I can put on this. I have to put a lot of spin on this. Got it. Slow down, perfect. I'm happy with that. Like I said, I need to get um, used to the balance and my stroke being a little bit different. So, so far we're doing better. Four in the corner, and then I have to prepare for the five. The six is in a really bad spot, so I might have to do a combination right after. I'm thinking I might go for a bank after, so I'm gonna try to stroke it, hopefully miss the pocket. And then try to go for, try to make it land over here somewhere. And then I can bank it over to the side pocket. All right, five in the corner. I don't have to call it, but I'm letting you know where it's going. Okay, I stroked that really bad right now. But this is where I wanted to land, so. All right, points are getting better. I'll add them up right now. All right, so that's four points. So we're at nine with four racks.
And if you're wondering if uh, you do get tired, by the way. Right now I'm starting to feel my, my feet a little bit tired, just having to try to balance. I hope everybody's doing good. Like I said, um, sorry if I haven't got to your text. I will be looking to see who's in here right after this next rack. I am at nine. We're on rack four with nine points. that three balls at. I am going to take ball in hand. Like I said, I'll go with the rules as I go. And welcome. We got 13 people here watching. Thank you. I'm going to take ball in hand. And that is my next shot, so most likely I'm going to go for a bank. Then the forward looks pretty simple, so I might end up with a combo. I think the combo would be perfect. What happens is going to move the two ball that way. I'll have an easy shot for the two. And then the three, I could back, uh, I could uh, reverse bank it here, get a better shot on the five. Combination. I'm hoping the two goes that way. I'll actually have a nice shot at it and then I'll be able to make the three afterwards. All right, it took, took, it took off on me. I'm gonna go for the two over here. I'm just glad I got an extra point. Like I said, I'm trying to beat 19 points. two points. All right, we got 11 points. So I got four more racks to go to beat 19. I'm starting to loosen up a little, so I just need better shots.
All right, I like the sound of that. <laughs> I will take ball in hand. We got 17 watching. I am using the bang time um, nine ball rules. So uh, I got to go in sequence. We got the one, the two, and the three. On a normal day, this would be easy, but uh, it's never normal with me. <laughs> in the corner. Get in there. The point counts. All right, let's count them. Looks like I got three, maybe four. One more, please. Ah. All right, three points. So we got 14, we're rack number six. I need to be 19 points. Like I said, 19's a number because that was the lowest that has been the lowest score over at Bangtan Pool. So I need uh, five more, five more balls. So far, I'm doing good with the break. I just need to uh, get my stroke going a little bit better on the on the new level. And I know I didn't take a break, but I will take a break right after and we'll, we'll chat a little bit and see what the comments. All right, so I'm at rack number six with 14 points. I'm gonna check the comments, is that, is that correct by the way? <laughs> Nobody said, no, it's not, so. take ball in hand of course I can only go for nine points now but this is a good rack this might be the rack that might get me to 19 And if I hit a ball, I'm going to foul, so 
I need to be uh, focused on that too. Let's count the balls. So we're on rack number seven, and we got we got six balls. One, two, three, four. Five, six. All right. I beat 19. Let's take it further. I will be uh, doing a little chat right afterwards. I'm just trying to stay alive on this thing. All right, let's keep going. Two more racks. And I will take ball in hand. And I, I, my next challenge is trying to run a rack, by the way. I'm going to try to kick at it. All 
All right, let's see what we got. We got one, two, three. All right, looks like we got three. Points with one more rack up to go. All right, let's try to beat, let's try to run this out. I am liking the spreads, by the way. All right, this is the ninth and final rack. I am taking ball in hand. All right, let's count the points. We got three, four, we got another six. I think that's it. All right, so that's nine racks. And I ended at 29. So 
So 29 was the highest. I was hoping to do better, but uh, like I said, I, I haven't shot with it much. I just started getting on it, but once I figure out my balance and all that, it'll be a lot better. But uh, nine racks, 29 points. Is that correct, guys, or do I need another rack? Ooh, it looks like I gotta get going right now. But like I said, um, when I'm on the hoverboard, it, I have to really focus on everything. And it does uh, help with a little bit with my mental game, especially when I shoot a lot more, you're gonna see. Uh, now I know 29 is my highest on it. This is the first time anybody in the world has ever attempted this, so that's another record. <laughs> So thank you guys for um, watching Russian Crush, Diego, Mayors over in Philippines, thank you. Nick G, thanks. Ron, Chucky, Andrew, my friend Marvelous. Let's see the green, nice to see you. Always happy to see you. Rinaldo over in the, uh, Brazil, thank you. Harold, how's it going, bud? Hope all the weather's good. Elite Legends, if you're still here, I haven't received uh, that thing in the mail. I'm getting hungry for that fat burger. <laughs> um, hopefully it didn't get lost, so I'm still waiting for the... Uh, package in the mail. Uh, I do want to make a video, by the way, Elite Legends, so I hope I get that soon and make that uh, giveaway um, video that, you know, receiving your package. Nisane, hello. Jim, what's up? Tango Bravo Zulu, how are you? Her destiny, always a pleasure to see you. Ken and Eric and everybody else, if you, you know, not able to write down on the uh, live chat, thank you for watching. I do have a match in about an hour over at Bank Time Pool. It starts at nine o'clock Eastern. So wish me luck. I'm hoping to shoot better than a 29 off a of hoverboard. <laughs> so, like I said, I wanted to be 19. My next record is um, running a rack on the hoverboard and of course beating 19. I should be able to beat, uh, or beating 29 now. So, Ken, how are you, buddy? Thank you, Ken. And uh, thank you guys, like I said, if you're new to the channel, This is just normal stuff that I do. <laughs> so, wish me luck. Darren, if you're watching, I know you're not because you're probably out there practicing. I'll see you, buddy, in about an hour. Uh, hit him well, I hope we both hit him well. Uh, I'm just glad one of us is gonna move forward. No, um, no harm, no foul. You know, we're both, um, it doesn't matter who goes over to the next round. As long as it's me or you. Thank you, Her Destiny. I am going to need it. I'm glad I'm going to be off the hoverboard. So, I think I could do better than 29. <laughs> so, 29 is a decent score. I think that uh, probably beat a couple other scores out there. So, thank you, buddy. Andrew. So, we'll see you guys. This is the awkward part where I start looking for where to close. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you very much. And we'll see you guys on the next video. And thanks for all the thumbs up, by the way. You guys are awesome. Here's one more back at you guys.